Bayonetta. Yes! Lads and ladies, boys and girls around the feckin' world. You've waited long enough, and it's finally here. Our journey continues with my queen, Bayonetta. Yes, it is time for Bayonetta 2. So if you lads and ladies out there are excited for today's episode, and the very first episode... What? Rodan, what is happening? Who is this? No one said you could touch. I love her hair. I love her hair. I love her new look. My queen is back. My queen is back. I was a love heart. Oh, that thing's back! Oh. As I was saying, if you're excited for this episode, hit that like button. The more likes we get, the more frequent these videos will come out. As I said in previous videos, I'm going to give you guys a chance to win a copy of the newest Bayonetta Trinity Masquerade Edition. We're going to give away one copy throughout this playthrough. And you have to stay to the very end to see who is going to be the winner. I can only manage to get one more. As you know, we've picked like four winners for the Trinity Masquerade Edition. I managed to get one more. So stay to the end of the playthrough to be in a chance of winning this awesome prize. All you need to do is leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and then comment down below why you're excited for Bayonetta 3. Whoa, what have we got here? Tag Climax? Play co-op online or local play with another player. View the Umbran Tears of Blood you have collected. Okay. Well, we're going into story, and we're going to play this on normal. In a universe of light and dark, where perception is reality. The Crescent Moon. Oh my god, I'm so pumped. There she is. Oh, that's the witch time sound. All right. Okay. So, is is that is that John? Are we with John? The legend of Ace. A legend from the dawn of time. Right. Nobody knows where the world came from. Okay, so I'm not I'm not a noob like I was. But the combos just seem to be different. Obviously our world was the one born from chaos. The three worlds all different but the same. And the one that ruled the chaos became known as Ace. My god, this feels fantastic. Whoa! Uh oh. Cutscene. Oh my god. Wait, 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 wait. What is this? This is new? Wait. Holy crap. This is insane. Ace yourself through reality. And those visions became our. These oh my god, it's so cool! What? Aesir's eyes were truly the eyes that created the world. However, 
Aesir pitied the humans for their naivete and lack of free will. So the power he wielded was split into two equal halves, and entrusted each to humanity's instincts. The right eye of light, and the left eye of darkness. Whoa, who's this? By dividing the power of the eyes of Aesir, humans gained free will. They could now choose. With control of the eyes of the world, the eyes that determine destiny, humans could choose their own paths. They awoke to their own identities. Man is but a reed, the most feeble thing in nature. But now we were thinking. Whoa, 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 whoa! Our first big step towards this dude is massive. The inheritors of the eyes of Aesir have been granted the power. Of That's Luca talking, right? What are these enemies, dude? These are insane looking. I. I Who's this? A Lumen Sage. Cheeky. No one bothered telling me any of your kind survived. I wonder if they're gonna explain her new look and why did she cut her hair? I'm not complaining though, her hair is so hot. Damn, the visuals look fantastic! What a huge well, improvement! At least you're the silent type. The last sage I met spent 20 minutes rambling on and on. What? What? Does she recognize who that is? Oh, okay, present day. Wait a minute! He's alive?! What the fuck?! How is he alive? There's no way he survived that. How? You will not escape this fate. We will perish together. My dear sweet child. At last, you have fulfilled your promise to me. Fear not, for I am always watching over you. Wait, so he did, he did die. Okay, so this was showing what happened after he right fell to Earth. Light was lost from the world forever. Along with its possessor, the last of the Lumen Sages. So we thought. Bewitchment after the end comes. Oh, <gasps> new map! We have World of Chaos and the end? Oh, what? <laughs> Where are we? Manhattan? New York? Sega, nice. Oh, cool. <gasps> Nintendo! Oh, that's awesome! Bro, this is so cool! Platinum Games. Team Little Angels. Yuji Shim Shimo Shimamura? Hideki! Yusuke. Oh my god, is that who I think it is? Yep. <laughs> oh, he's carrying all the shopping for her. You know what I need? Some heels without guns. You don't mind if we make a quick stop, do you? Do you know what day's coming up? 
Here I was shopping, minding my own business, then you show up and turn me into a damn porter. Seriously, Bayonetta, you still haven't paid me back for the car. Hey, whoa! Now, now, is that any way to speak to an old friend? Besides, I did that job for you, for free. But, uh, do I really have to tell everyone how you grabbed onto my leg, sobbing like a schoolboy? Look at her, hey, so glamorous. This is why I can't have good things. You're some piece of work, you know that? If you weren't already lined up to go to Inferno, you'd be well on your way with all the shit you pull. Dressing up like a nun just so you could off some angels and keep the underworld happy. Hey, I'm talking to you. <clears throat> uh, shit. But if it's that or getting torn limb from limb for eternity in whatever circle of Inferno, you witches go to if you break the contract. Forget about it. Forget about it. Bastards all damn day. Oh, hey. What the hell? But what the fuck you wasting your time trying to send some schmucks off to the afterlife for? Whoa. Done and done. Let's go home, Enzo. Hey, wait a second. I ain't done here. If I don't get what I came for, I'm gonna be the biggest mutt in the city. And what is it that you came to fetch, my dear? Eh, yeah, real funny. I know better than to tell you a damn thing. I'll never hear the fucking end of Oh, there's Jean. Oh! Oh, Jean's got a new look, too. Just let her hair down. And let her hair grow out. You always know how to make an entrance, Jean. A rare sight to see you in the city. Just had something I had to look into. Cereza, you haven't felt anything strange recently. Now that you mention it, I still haven't quite figured out how a broke, bumbling wise guy managed to turn himself into a semi-respectable family man. Forget about it. Forget about and it. Racer shit. You're about as sweet as my Nona's grappa, you know that? Some witch with amnesia goes around calling herself a weapon, and it turns out she really got stuck with a kid's nickname. That shit's rich, I tell you what. Our friends in Paradiso are far too quiet. I'm sure you've noticed. But they aren't the only ones. Pray tell. Our friends down south seem to be a bit upset as well. And now in life, the annual holiday parade is being held today. City police have closed off roads to prepare for the massive influx of merrymakers expected to take in this year's festivities. Set to be headlined by a flyover from the military's aerial acrobatics unit. Police have now to lose the previous parade may break all time attendance records. Oh shit! The Platinum Stars! Crap. We need to hurry up and get Ed and Edna's presents, or I'm gonna get it. Ed and Edna's. We'll talk later. I'll see you back home. Don't forget to pick up the things for the party. I'm loving the two of their new looks. They look fantastic. It's almost given off a different vibe, this game. What's the matter with you? I told you what I'm after. A jet. But in a good way. I want a toy jet. You know, the kind with wings, flies in the sky. No, I'm not buying any damned angels. Yellow, blue, I don't care what color they are. I learned my lesson with those bastards, you hear me? Just a normal damn jet, please. You hear that? I want one of those! The thing's flying in the air right now! That's the one. That's the biggest one you got in the store, right? Wrap it up nicely. It's a present for God's sakes. <laughs> uh oh, that's flying low. No! You know what? Screw the pretty ribbon! Just hurry up and put it in the box, will ya? Oh, wait, is that crashing or. Oh, 
there she is. Oh my god, there she is! <gasps> Look at her! Oh, here we go again. Acceptance. We're going to fight in this dress? <laughs> oh my god, it's happening again! <gasps> Oh my god! I fucking love this game! Um, I, I just need a minute. I, I need a minute. I need... <sighs> Cheers to Bayonetta 2. The thirst continues. So this game can be played with touch controls. Alright. I'm gonna mess around with some combos here. I love that. Oh my god. So cool. Love it. Oh, yes. Look at her go. She's fucking amazing, man. The combat in this game is just untouchable. Holy shit. Which time? Okay. God, the combat and this is even better than the first game. I didn't think that was possible. So close. I love the music as well. Why is she dressed as Santa Claus? <laughs> but I don't believe in Santa. Watch your mouth into. Don't want anyone offering you for sacrilege before you pay your tax. I'd be fucking leaveable. <laughs> Poor Enzo. <laughs> He's just trying to make ends meet, bro. He got a new car now, to be fair. The hell is this crazy taxi? Holy shit! <laughs>
That's more like it. Amazing. Amazing. I believe! <laughs> Oh, he got the toy jet. <laughs> Ow. Now it's time to be naughty. You awoke me and the fire. Wait. Is this new? On brand climax. Attack on enemies and build your magic gauge. Then use your build up energy to unleash amazing special attacks. On brand climax will allow you to unleash a barrage of infernal weaves. <gasps> Come on. Let's go! I'm ready! Go! Let's go! Oh, I knew that wasn't our weave! Hey, John! Nice to see you! What the fuck is that?! <laughs> oh my god! This is so awesome! Let's try it. Hey, that's it. Oh my god, this is like Devil Trigger, bro. This is insane. Let's go, combos for days, bro. Green Laurel? A laurel-shaped gem that contains vital essence in crystallization form. Revives one's vitality instantly. <gasps> Sweet. Okay, I'll take silver. Not not bad, not great. Whoa, dude, is this a boss fight? Belief? See ya. Oh, here comes John. Oh, 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 nice. Hey. Get out of it.
Oh my god, this is full on! This is fucking incredible! That was quick. Did you get everything? I got the caviar. You think they're still open? <laughs> Love when we're discussing the shopping list in the middle of all this. Not Christmas without caviar. Let's finish this quickly then. Yes! Team up! This is gonna be easy with the two of us, bro. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> this is what I've been hoping for in the sequel. It's just epic team ups with John. This is incredible. I love it so much. Here we go, climax time. Let's go, John! Oh my god, the bicycle gang! Oh, oh, chomp chomps! Yes! Max bonus! Eat it! Holy shit. Oh my god, this is just a complete and utter adrenaline rush. Whoa. What's happening? Whoa, that's not right. That's not normal. Devour of the Divine? Gamora? That's not. What is happening? Jean? Did her soul just get whacked out of her body? It just grab her. They went straight for. What is this? What happened to my? We got wings, bro! Oh my god, we're actually flying with her! Not just gliding, but freaking... Flying! Yes! Take that, you! Hey! Now I can't go near him. Whoa! Whoa! So I got away with that. So close. Is that all you've got? Get we have this, dude. We have this. Almost. 
That's it. We have it. No. No. Bro. Oh, shit. Oh, I didn't have the right button. No way, dude. Ah. Oh. That's. That's. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> That's going to destroy my rank now. I was doing so well. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Okay, I know what button press. So we good. Uppercut. Nice. Time to finish this. Ooh, look at that shot. Oh, oh God. I wasn't ready. Damn it. Whoa, what the hell did she summon this time? There's a whole feckin' kaiju battle happening with her weaves. Oh my god. My heart rate's going through the roof. Jean. Oh, bollocks. I only got silver, dude. Lumen Sage. Is revenge not all you desire? I know the one who destroyed your world. I know the one who destroyed your love. Who? Back in the gates of hell. Dead witches get dragged to hell. It is what it is. Jean's gonna wander inferno suffering for eternity. Them's the breaks. I didn't ask you to tell me what I already know, Rodan. Especially if you're going to be flip about it. You know better than that. You're not the kind to let that sort of summon go out of control, Bayonetta. Something's up. The balance of powers that keep things in check don't feel right, does it? You know, she's pretty hot for a dead chick. <laughs> you wasn't a big fan of her shit when she was in the realm of the living. But looking at her now, nah, still not a fan. <laughs> She's not dead, Enzo. Yeah, Enzo. She's so being a creep. Right, You're only really dead after your soul's been completely absorbed into another realm of the Trinity. But that's just a matter of time. Because I don't see no way of saving a soul lost in hell. What about the gates? The real gates of hell. I can't stop you from trying to use them, but I don't think you got a chance down there. I'll see what I can do about putting her on ice for a while. You need this. The heart of an Umbra Witch. The magic that keep your kind alive in this world for eternities. Should keep her body in this realm stable, but you'll need to reunite this with her soul. If you're gonna try and bring her back, I figure you got about a day before it's game over. Oh. 
Enzo, you've got a jet, right? What? No. No, 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 oh. no, 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 no. I do not know. Listen, I appreciate the situation, but you know what today is? My kids got cookies baked for me at home. They're waiting for me. And I still got a place Santa tonight. <laughs> uh oh. Let the real Santa take care of the presents. Now let's go. Hey, I said I believe. But Ed and Edna, you can't put one over on those two little fuckers, let me tell you. <laughs> hey! Let go! Let go of me! <laughs> 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 oh my god what an intro world of chaos we did it oh bronze oh great here we go again with the shite ranks that is going to be it for our first episode of bayonetta 2 now don't don't get too disappointed because i wanted to just play the intro to the game for the first episode get the prologue and be reintroduced to the characters that I already absolutely adore. And oh my god, I, as much as you guys have been saying it in the comment section over and over again, that if you love Bayonetta 1, you're going to adore Bayonetta 2. I, I took that with a grain of salt because I'm like, Bayonetta 1 was just an absolutely amazing experience and I loved it so, so much. And I'm like, how can they top this? How can they make this even sexier than the first game? How, how can they do it? And they did. <laughs> they did it. And then so. I absolutely love this experience. This overall intro was just phenomenal. And this reintroduction to Bayonetta. And obviously they've spent a good bit of time now on Earth. And they've established themselves. And they have built on relationships. Uh, and all that stuff. But now something else has happened. Something that's out of the ordinary. With uh, Bayonetta's weave. Uh, it seemed that that dinosaur creature that she summons all the time. Had been possessed by some sort of power. I'm assuming it's a power from hell. Jean has been captured and is now in hell. For all eternity so now we got to go save jean which is awesome so this whole intro prologue experience was just whoa i i genuinely need to stop here to like process everything that i've just consumed here amazing amazing oh my god <laughs> i can't wait to play some more the next few episodes of course are going to be much longer we're going to try to do at least two maybe three chapters at a time depending on time depending you know how much i can actually take at one time because this game is full on there's so much being thrown at you at once it's rapid paced it's it's amazing i love it so so much so maybe two chapters at a time i think is where we're going to approach this going forward so if you guys love bayonetta and you're and you're hyped for this and you want to get excited and get prepared for bayonetta 3 then you know what to do just subscribe to the channel turn on the notification bell so you don't miss a single episode when they drop because we are going to be playing this up until the release of Bayonetta 3, which is the end of this month. So we don't have much time. And I'm going to try to get this playthrough done and dusted before then. So then we can officially start Bayonetta 3, which I think I'm going to do a live stream series on it. So you guys can be part of live chat over at twitch.tv forward slash dvgeek when we live stream the game. So it's going to be great. It's going to be fun. And I can't fucking wait. Oh my god, so hyped, so hyped. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe to the channel. That's two of the steps that you need to do in order to be a part of the giveaway that we'll be doing in this playthrough. And of course, comment down below why you're excited for Bayonetta 3. And then if you put all those things into the, you know, into the algorithm, if you will, then you guys would be in a chance of winning the last copy of the Trinity Masquerade Edition that I will be giving away. Anyway. Thank you all so much for watching, and as always, stay geeky, stay cool, be awesome, and be happy, and I'll see you dudes in my next Bayonetta video. See you later, dudes!